alternating dumbbell bicep curl. Grab a pair of dumbbells and stand with your feet shoulder width apart. Using a palms in grip, curl your left arm toward your shoulder and squeeze at the top position. Alternate back and forth with your right arm. Back extension. Hook your heels into a back extension station, keeping your back naturally arched. Lower your torso until your body is bent 90 degrees. Then raise your torso back up until it's in line with your lower body. Hold this position for 3 seconds. Barbell Curl Grab a barbell with an underhand shoulder width grip and let it hang at arm's length in front of your hips. Stand tall with your feet shoulder width apart. Your arms should be completely straight, palms facing forward. Curl the bar towards your shoulders without moving your elbows. Pause at the top and squeeze your biceps before lowering to the starting position. Barbell Deadlift Load a barbell and set it on the floor. Squat in front with your feet shoulder width apart. Grab it overhand with your hands just outside your legs, your shoulders over the bar, arms straight, and your back flat. Tighten your core, squeeze your glutes, and push your heels through the floor to raise yourself up. Barbell Front Squat Grab a barbell with an overhand shoulder width grip. Bring your elbows forward so your palms face up. Rest the bar on your front delts. Push your hips back into a squat position. Lower yourself until your thighs are parallel to the floor. Pause, then push yourself up to the starting position. Barbell Front Squat to Push Press Grab a barbell with an overhand shoulder width grip. Bring your elbows forward so your palms face up. Rest the bar on your front delts. Push your hips back into a squat position, lowering yourself until your thighs are parallel to the floor. Pause, then push yourself up to the starting position while simultaneously pressing the bar straight overhead. Barbell Lunge Start with a shoulder width stance and the rest of the barbell across your traps. Take a large step forward with your left leg as you descend into a split squat position. When your front leg is parallel to the floor, push yourself back up explosively to the starting position. Repeat on your right leg. Barbell Reverse Lunge Start with a barbell resting across your traps, feet about hip width apart. With your left leg, take a large step backward so that only the ball of that foot touches the floor. Your back knee should end up just an inch or two off the floor while your front leg is bent 90 degrees. Push off from your front leg to return to the starting position. Barbell Rollout Load a pair of small plates onto a barbell. Kneel on an exercise mat with your shoulders directly over the bar with an overhand shoulder width grip. Brace your core as you roll the bar out in front, keeping your knees in place through the movement. 
Go as far as you can without arching your back, touching the floor with anything above your knees. Pause, then pull back to the starting position. Barbell Rotation Load a barbell using the low weight on one end. Wedge the other end into a corner of your workout room. Stand facing the loaded end. Lock your fingers around the end of the bar and hold it in front of your face. Pivot your feet and torso simultaneously to move the top of the bar down and to your left side. Lift the bar up and down towards your other knee. That's one repetition. Barbell Row Stand with your feet shoulder width apart, knees bent 15 to 30 degrees. Keep your torso straight with a slight arch in your back as you lean forward at the hips. Grab the barbell off the floor with an overhand grip slightly wider than shoulder width. Let the bar hang in front of you. Without moving your upper body, row the bar just below your chest and squeeze your back together for a second at the top. Slowly return to the starting position. Barbell squat and one arm press. Wedge one end of a barbell into a bench or wall corner. Squat and hold the other end in your right hand. Stand and push the barbell until your arm is extended. Return to the starting position. That's one rep. Do all your reps on the right and repeat on the left. Barbell Step Up Stand in front of a sturdy bench or step with a barbell resting across your traps. Place your left foot flat on the bench. Push down through your left heel to lift your body into a standing position. Lower yourself to the starting position. Repeat for your right leg. Barbell Sumo Deadlift Begin with a bar loaded on the ground. Approach the bar so that the bar intersects with the middle of the feet. The feet should be set very wide, near the collars. Bend at the hips to grab the bar. The arms should be directly below the shoulders, inside the legs, and you can use a pronated grip, a mixed grip, or hook grip. Then lower your hips, looking forward with your head, with your chest up. Drive through the floor, spreading your feet apart with your weight on your heels. Body Weight Jump Squat Place your fingers on the back of your head and pull your elbows back so they're in line with your body. Dip your knees in preparation to leap. Explosively jump as high as you can. When you land, immediately squat down and jump again. Cable Chop Stand to the left of a high cable machine and hold the handle with both hands, arms straight. Step your right foot one to two feet in front of your left, knees slightly bent. Keeping your arms straight and eyes on your hands, pull the handle down and across your body until it's outside your left leg. Slowly return to start. Cable Crossover Adjust the pulleys on a cable machine to the highest point possible on both sides and use single grip handles. Set your desired weight on the weight stacks and grab each handle with your palms facing down. Take a small forward. Your arms should be slightly bent at the elbows with your chest up and eyes facing forward. Rotate your shoulders only moving your arms in a circular motion. Slowly bring the handles together and cross them over in front of your body, making sure to squeeze your chest as you cross the handles over. 
slowly lower the weight back to the starting position. Cable face pull with external rotation. Attach a rope to the high pulley of a cable station and grab an end with each hand. Step back a few steps away from the weight stack until your arms are straight in front of you. In one movement, pull the middle of the rope towards your eyes. As you flare your elbows, bend your arms and squeeze your shoulder blades together. Pause, then reverse the movement back to the starting position. Cable Pull Attach a rope handle to the low pulley of a cable machine. Grab an end of the rope in each hand and stand with your back to the weight stack. Bend at your hips and knees and lower your torso until it's at about a 45 degree angle to the floor. Thrust your hips forward, squeeze your glutes, and raise your torso back to the starting position. That's one rep. Chair Dip Hold on to the seat of a sturdy chair behind you, your feet resting on a bench or a chair in front of you. Keeping your upper ridged, slowly lower your body until your upper arms are parallel to the floor. Your torso should remain straight. Pause, then press back up to the starting position. Close Grip Bench Press Lie on a flat bench with your feet firmly anchored to the floor. Grab a barbell with an overhand grip less than shoulder width apart, about 6 to 8 inches. Unrack the bar and lower it to your chest, just above your nipples. Then slowly press it up to the starting position, just short of a lockout. Close Grip Chin Up Hold on to a chin up bar with an underhand grip less than shoulder width. Let your body hang at arm's length. Pull your chest to the bar. Once the top of your chest touches the bar, pause and then slowly lower your body to a dead hang. Close Grip Lat Pull Down Sit down in a lat pull down station and grab the bar with an underhand grip with your hands placed 6 to 8 inches apart. Without moving your torso, pull the bar down to your chest as you continue to squeeze your shoulder blades. Pause, then slowly return to the starting position. Crunch. Lie on your back with your knees bent, feet on the floor, and hands behind your ears. Curl up so your shoulder blades rise off the floor. Pause and then contract your core. Then lower yourself to the starting position. Decline Dumbbell Press Sit on a decline bench and place your feet under the leg brace. Rest the dumbbell on each thigh. Grab the dumbbells with an overhand grip and lie back on the bench. Lower the dumbbells to the side of your chest. Your palms should face outwards and your arms should be bent under each weight. Slowly press the dumbbells up from the elbows until your arms are fully extended. Pause briefly at the top then lower the dumbbells to return to the starting position. Decline Easy Bar Tricep Extension 
Grab an easy curl bar using an overhand grip, your hands a little less than shoulder width apart. Lie face up on a decline bench with your arms straight and hold the bar over your forehead. Without moving your upper arms, bend your elbows to lower the bar toward your head. Pause and lift the weight back up by straightening your arms. Decline Hammer Curl Grab a pair of dumbbells and lie your chest against the bench that is set to a 45 degree incline. Let your arms hang in front of your body. Without moving your upper arms, bend your elbows and curl the dumbbells as close to your shoulders as you can. Pause, then slowly lower the weights back to the starting position. Diagonal Hand to Toe Touch Lie face up on the floor with your right leg bent 90 degrees. Keep your left arm at your side and your right arm diagonally above your head. Without rounding your lower back, raise your left leg and right arm and have them meet in the middle of your body. Return to the starting position, complete all your reps and then switch arms and legs and repeat. Dumbbell Bulgarian Split Squat Hold a pair of dumbbells next to your sides, palms facing each other. Stand in a staggered stance, your left foot in front of your right. Place just the instep of your back foot on a bench. Slowly lower your body as far as you can. Pause, then push yourself back up to the starting position as quickly as you can. Complete the prescribed number of reps with your left foot forward. Then do the same number with your right foot in front of your left. Dumbbell Chest Press Lie on a flat bench holding a pair of heavy dumbbells with your arms extended over your chest and your palms facing your feet. Be sure to keep your feet flat on the floor. Slowly lower the dumbbells to the outsides of your chest. Pause for a second, then push them back to the starting position. Dumbbell Deadlift Set up a pair of heavy dumbbells on the floor and stand them between feet shoulder width apart. Bend at your hips and knees and grab the dumbbells with an overhand grip. Without rounding your lower back, stand up with the dumbbells then lower back down to the floor. Dumbbell Front Squat Hold a pair of dumbbells so that your palms are facing each other and rest one of the dumbbell heads on the medius part of the shoulder. Brace your abs and lower your body as far as you can by pushing your hips back and bending your knees. Pause, then slowly push yourself back to the starting position. Keep your body as upright as you can at all times. Don't allow your elbows to drop down as you squat. Dumbbell Get Up Lie face up with your legs straight. Hold a dumbbell in your left hand with your arms straight above you. Roll onto your right side and prop yourself up on your right elbow. Place one foot flat on the floor. Simply stand up while keeping your arms straight and the dumbbell above you at all times. Push yourself to a kneeling position. Once standing, Reverse the movement to return to the starting position. Complete the prescribed number of reps. Then do the same number with your right hand holding the weight. Dumbbell Hang Pull Grab a pair of dumbbells with an overhand grip and hold them just below knee height. 
Set your feet shoulder width apart. Explosively pull the dumbbells upward. Bend your elbows and pull the weights. In one movement, straighten your hips, knees, and ankles. Dumbbell Kickback Place your left hand and left knee on a flat bench. Your lower back should be naturally arched and your torso parallel to the floor. Hold your right upper arm so that it's parallel to the floor, with your elbow bent. Without moving your right upper arm, raise your forearm until your arm is completely straight. Reverse the movement back to the starting position. Dumbbell Lateral Raise Stand with your back straight and feet approximately shoulder width apart, holding a dumbbell in each hand with a neutral grip. Let your arms hang down by your side, palms facing into your body. This is the start position. Keeping your arms fully extended and your torso firm, lift the dumbbells out to your sides and up until they reach shoulder level. Hold for a second while squeezing your shoulder muscles. Return to the starting position and repeat. Dumbbell Lunge Standing holding a pair of dumbbells at your sides, your palms facing inward. Take a big step forward with your left foot and lower body until your front and back knees are bent 90 degrees and your back knee is about an inch off the floor. Push back up and repeat with the other leg. Dumbbell Lying Tricep Extension Grab a pair of dumbbells and lie face up on a flat bench. Hold the dumbbells over your head with straight arms, your palms facing each other. Without moving your upper arms, bend your elbows to lower the dumbbells until your forearms are beyond parallel to the floor. Pause, then lift the weights back to the starting position by straightening your arms. Dumbbell Push Press Stand holding a pair of dumbbells just outside your shoulders, arms bent, and palms facing each other. Set your feet shoulder width, your knees slightly bent. While keeping the dumbbells at shoulder level, bend your knees and explosively push up with your legs as you press the weight straight over your shoulders. Lower the dumbbells back to the starting position and repeat. Dumbbell Split Squat Hold a pair of dumbbells at arm's length next to your sides, your palms facing each other. Stagger your stance, your left foot in front of your right. Slowly lower your body as far as you can. Pause, then push yourself back up to the starting position as quickly as you can. Repeat the move with your right foot in front of your left. That's one rep. Dumbbell Squat Stand, holding a dumbbell on each side with arms hanging straight down of you. And bend your knees until your thighs are just past parallel to the floor. Your back should be at roughly 45 degrees, your eyes looking straight ahead. Push through your heels to extend your legs, straightening back up to return to standing. Dumbbell Step Up Grab a pair of dumbbells and let them hang by your sides. Stand in front of a bench or step and place your foot firmly on the bench. Make sure the step is high enough so your knee is bent 90 degrees. Without using momentum, press your left heel into the step and push your body up until your left leg is straight and you're standing on one leg on the bench, keeping your right foot elevated. 
Lower your body back down until your right foot touches the floor. That's one repetition. Complete the prescribed number of repetitions with your left leg. Then do the same number with your right leg. Dumbbell Straight Leg Deadlift Grab a pair of dumbbells at arm's length in front of your thighs. Without rounding your lower back, bend at your hips and lower your torso toward the floor. Pause and return to the starting position. Dumbbell Thrusters Grab a pair of dumbbells and hold them just above your shoulders, with palms facing each other. Stand with your feet shoulder width apart. Lower your body down into a squat by pushing your hips back until the thighs are at least parallel to the floor. Push through your heels to return to the starting position, while simultaneously pushing the dumbbells straight up above head and thrusting your hips forward. Your arms and legs should be straight at the ending position. Two-Arm Dumbbell Row With a dumbbell in each hand, bend your knees slightly and bring your torso forward by bending at the waist. As you bend, make sure to keep your back straight until it is almost parallel to the floor. Without moving your torso, lift the dumbbells to your side, keeping the elbows close to your body. At the top position, squeeze the back muscles and hold for a second. Slowly lower the weight again to the starting position as you inhale. Repeat for the recommended amount of repetitions. Easy Bar Pullover Grab an easy curl bar with an overhand grip, your hands a little less than shoulder width apart. Lie face up on a flat bench and hold the bars straight over your chin. Without changing the angle of your elbows, Slowly lower the bar back beyond your head until your upper arms are in line with your body or parallel to the floor. Pause, then slowly raise the bar back to the starting position. Goblet Squat Hold the dumbbell vertically at chest level, using both hands to cup the weight. Take a shoulder width stance. Then, push your hips back by bending your knees until your thighs are parallel with the floor. Drive through your heels to push yourself up to the starting position. Hanging Leg Raise Grab a chin-up bar with an overhand grip, your hands slightly wider than shoulder width. Simultaneously bend your knees, raise your hips, and curl your lower back underneath you as you lift your thighs towards your chest. Pause for a second when the fronts of your thighs reach your chest, then lower your legs and repeat. High Box Jump Stand in front of a sturdy, secure box that's high enough so that you have to jump with great effort in order to land on the top of it. Your feet should be shoulder width apart. Dip your knees. Jump up onto the box with a soft landing. Step down and reset your feet. Hip raise on BOSU ball. Lie face up with your head and upper back on a BOSU ball, your knees bent, and your feet flat on the floor. Raise your hips so your body forms a straight line with your shoulders to your knees. Pause for up to 5 seconds in the up position. Then lower your body back to the starting position.
Incline Bench Press Grab a pair of dumbbells and lie on your back on an incline bench. Lift the dumbbells up to arm's length so they're over your chin and hold them with your palms turned towards your feet. Slowly lower the weights to your chest. Pause, then push them back over your chin. Incline Bench Row Grab a pair of dumbbells and lie chest down on a 45 degree incline bench. Let your arms hang straight down, palms facing each other. Row the dumbbells to the side of your chest by bending your elbows and squeezing your shoulder blades. Pause for a second and lower the weights all the way down to the starting position. Incline Dumbbell Fly Set up a bench to a low incline. Grab a pair of dumbbells and hold them over your chest with your elbows slightly bent and your palms facing out. Without changing the bend in your elbows, slowly lower the dumbbells down and slightly back until your upper arms are parallel to the floor. Lateral Squat Stand with your feet approximately twice shoulder width apart. Keeping your right leg straight, push your hips back and to the left. Then bend your left knee and lower your body until your left thigh is parallel to the floor. Your feet should stay glued to the floor at all times. Pause, press through your heel to power up to the starting position. Low Box Lateral Shuffle Stand with your left foot on a low box or step and your right foot on the floor, about two feet to the right of the box. Bend your knees slightly, keep your chest up, and bend your arms 90 degrees, keeping your elbows close to your body. A. Push off your left foot and jump to your left, landing with your right foot on the box. B. And your left foot on the floor, knees bent. C. Push off your right foot to jump back to the starting position. That's one rep. Lying Dumbbell Raise Grab a dumbbell in your right hand and lie on your left side on a flat bench. Prop yourself up with your left elbow. Let your right arm hang straight down so that it's perpendicular to the floor with your palm facing behind you and your elbow slightly bent. Without changing the bend in your elbow, raise your arm straight above your shoulder while rotating your arm so that your palm is facing your head. Medicine Ball Side Throws Grab a medicine ball and stand sideways about 3 feet from a brick or concrete wall, your left side closer to the wall. Hold the ball at chest level with your arms straight and rotate your torso to your right. Quickly switch directions and throw as hard as you can against the wall to your left. As the ball rebounds off the wall, catch it and repeat the movement. Complete the prescribed number of repetitions, then do the same number with your right side facing the wall, throwing from your left. Medicine Ball Slams Hold a medicine ball with both hands and stand with your feet at shoulder width. This will be your starting position. Initiate the counter movement by raising the ball above your head and fully extending your body. Reverse the motion, slamming the ball into the ground directly in front of you as hard as you can. Receive the ball with both hands on the bounce and repeat the movement. Mountain Climber Get in a classic push-up position with your hands on the floor directly under your shoulders and your legs straight behind you. Lift one foot off the floor and bring your knee towards your chest. Straighten your leg back out. Move your other knee to your chest and return that leg to the starting position.
Neutral Grip Chest Press Grab a pair of dumbbells and lay on a flat bench. Keep your feet flat on the floor. Using a palms facing each other grip, start with your arms extended directly above you. Lower the weights to the side of your chest. Pause briefly, then return to the starting position. Overhead Farmer's Walk Grab a pair of dumbbells and press them over your head, palms facing each other. Walk forward, maintaining an upright torso and braced core. Parallel Bar Dip Position yourself with a hand on each bar, and then take a small jump to help you get into the starting position with your arms locked out. Begin by flexing the elbow, slowly lowering your body under control until your arms break 90 degrees. Reverse the motion by pushing yourself back up into the starting position. Push-up Get down on the floor and assume a push-up position. Your hands should be slightly wider than and in line with your shoulders. Your feet slightly wider than hip width apart and your arms straight. Keep your back flat. Lower your body until your chest nearly touches the floor. Pause and then push yourself back up to the starting position. Reverse Crunch Lie face up on an inclined bench. Grab the bench behind your head for support. Raise your hips off the bench and crunch them in towards your chest. Pause for a second before slowly lowering your legs back down just above the floor. Reverse Dumbbell Lunge Hold a pair of dumbbells at arm's length next to your sides, your palms facing each other. Stand tall with your feet hip width apart and brace your core. Step backward with your left leg, then lower your body into a lunge. That's one rep. Do all your reps and then repeat on your other leg. Russian Twist Feet Elevated Sit on the floor with your knees bent. Hold your arms straight out in front of your chest with your palms together. Lean back so your torso is at a 45 degree angle to the floor. Raise your feet a few inches off the floor and hold them there as you perform the movement. Brace your core and rotate your torso to the right. Pause, then reverse your movement and twist all the way back to the left as far as you can. Seated Ab Crunch Sit on the edge of a bench and grip the edge of the pad for support. Lean back slightly, extending your legs down and away and keeping your heels off the floor. Bend your knees and slowly raise your legs towards your chest. At the same time, lean forward with your upper body, allowing your chest to approach your thighs. Return to the starting position. Seated Barbell Good Morning Sit upright on a bench and hold a barbell across your upper back. Keeping the natural arch in your lower back, bend forward at your hips and lower your torso as far as you comfortably can. Pause, then raise your torso back to the starting position.
Seated dumbbell curl to press. Hold a pair of dumbbells at arm's length and sit on a bench. Without moving your upper arms, curl the dumbbells up to your shoulders. Rotate your palms so they face away from your body and press the weights above your head. Return to the starting position and repeat. Seated Reverse Dumbbell Curls Grab a pair of dumbbells using an overhand grip and sit tall on a bench or Swiss ball. Without moving your upper arms, bend your elbows and curl the dumbbells as close to your shoulders as you can. Pause, then slowly lower the weights back to the starting position. Each time you return to the starting position, completely straighten your arms. Side plank with low cable row. Hook up a handle to the low pulley of a cable machine. Brace your core and raise your body into a side plank. Grab the handle with your right hand. Bend your elbow and pull the handle to your rib cage, keeping your hips pushed up and forward. Slowly straighten your arm back out in front of you. Side Plank with Touch Lie on your left side and prop your upper body up on your left forearm. Bend your right arm and place your hand behind your head. Raise your hips, brace your abs, and hold this position. Keeping your right hand in place, rotate and touch your right elbow to the floor without allowing your hips to push backward. Perform all your right arm touches and then repeat with your left arm. Single Arm Cable Chest Press Set a cable station handle at shoulder height. Stand facing away from the weight stack and grab the handle with your right hand, palm facing down. Elbow bent, extend your left arm in front of you. Step your right foot back into a split stance, knees bent. A. Brace your abs and forcefully drive the handle forward, while bringing your left elbow back. B. Do all reps, then switch sides and repeat. Single Arm Dumbbell Deadlift Use just one dumbbell for this version of the exercise. Place the dumbbell on the floor next to your right ankle. Bend at your hips and knees and grab the dumbbell in your right hand with an overhand grip. Without allowing your lower back to round, stand up with the dumbbell. Lower the dumbbell to the floor. Complete the prescribed number of repetitions with the weight in your right hand. Then do the same number with it in your left. Single Arm Dumbbell Row Grab a dumbbell in your right hand and place your left hand on a flat bench. Your torso should be nearly parallel to the floor. Let the dumbbell hang at arm's length. This is the starting position. Row the weight to your side. Pause and return to the starting position. Do 5 reps, switch sides, and repeat for a total of 10 reps per set. Single Arm Dumbbell Swing Grab a dumbbell with an overhand grip and hold it in front of your waist at arm's length. Keeping your lower back slightly arched, bend at your hips and knees and swing the dumbbell between your legs. Keeping your arms straight, thrust your hips forward, straighten your knees, and swing the dumbbell up to shoulder level as you rise to standing position. Now, swing the weight back and forth. Switch arms. Single Arm Inverted Row 
Set a chin-up bar or other bar at hip height. Lie underneath the bar with your heels on the floor and slightly wider than shoulder width apart using an overhand grip. Keeping your body in a straight line from head to toe, pull your chest up to the bar using your back muscles. Slowly lower yourself until your arms are completely straight. Single Leg Donkey Calf Raise Cross your left foot behind your right ankle and balance yourself on the ball of your right foot with your right heel on the floor or hanging off a step. Keeping your back naturally arched, bend at your hips and lower your torso until your upper body is almost parallel to the floor. Place your hands on a sturdy object for support. Lift your right heel as high as you can. Pause, then lower and repeat. Complete the prescribed number of reps with your right leg. Then do the same number with your left. Single Leg Squat on Bench Stand on your left leg on a bench or a box that's about knee height. Hold your arms straight out in front of you. Balancing on your left foot, bend your left knee and slowly lower your body until your right heel lightly touches the floor. Pause, then push yourself up. Complete the prescribed number of reps with your left leg, then immediately do the same number with your right. Single Leg Standing Calf Raise Grab a dumbbell in your right hand and stand on a step, block, or 25-pound weight plate. Cross your left foot behind your right ankle and balance yourself on the ball of your right foot with your right heel on the floor or hanging off a step. Lift your right heel as high as you can. Pause, then lower and repeat. Complete the prescribed number of reps with your right leg. Then do the same number with your left while holding the dumbbell in your left hand. Single Leg Straight Leg Deadlift Using an overhand grip, hold a pair of dumbbells at arm's length in front of your thighs. Stand with your left knee slightly bent and your right foot off the floor. Keeping your right leg in line with your torso, lower your torso until it's almost parallel to the floor. Pause and return to the starting position. After 20 seconds, switch legs and repeat. Sledgehammer Slam Stand about a foot from a tire with your knees slightly bent. Rotate your upper back slightly to the right and raise a sledge above over your right side. Don't rotate your hips. Brace your abs and swing the hammer down. Aim for the tire's inside edge. Do all reps and switch sides. Standing Dumbbell Curl Grab a pair of dumbbells and let them hang at arm's length next to your sides. Turn your arms so that your palms face forward. Without moving your upper arms, bend your elbows and curl the dumbbells as close to your shoulders as you can. Pause, then slowly lower the weights back to the starting position. Standing Single Arm Shoulder Press Stand holding a dumbbell at eye level with your arm bent, palm forward, and your other hand on your hip. Press the dumbbell straight overhead and then lower it to the starting position. Repeat with your other arm. Swiss Ball Dumbbell Chest Press Grab a pair of dumbbells and lie on your back on a Swiss ball. 
Raise your hips so that your body forms a straight line from your knees to your shoulders. Your palms should be facing out, but turned slightly inward. Without changing the angle of your hands, lower the dumbbells to the sides of your chest. Pause, then bring the weights back up to the starting position as quickly as you can. Straighten your arms completely at the top of each repetition. Swiss Ball Easy Bar Pullover Grab an easy curl bar with an overhand grip, your hands a little less than shoulder width apart. Lie face up on a Swiss ball, placing your middle and upper back firmly on the ball. Raise your hips so that your body forms a straight line from your knees to your shoulders. Hold the bar straight over your chin. Without changing the bend in your elbows, lower the bar until it's in line with your body. Pause, then slowly raise the bar back to the starting position. Swiss Ball Hip Raise with Leg Curl Lie face up on the floor with your lower legs and heels on a Swiss ball. Push your hips up so that your body forms a straight line from your shoulders to your knees. Without pausing, pull your heels toward you and roll the ball as close as possible to your butt. Pause for 1-2 to two seconds, then reverse the motion. Lower your hips back to the floor. That's one rep. Swiss Ball Jackknife Get in a push-up position with your shins resting on a stability ball, hands slightly more than shoulder width apart. Keeping your abs tight, bring your knees toward your chest until your toes are on top of the ball. Slowly straighten your legs so the ball rolls back to the starting position. Swiss Ball Oblique Twist Lie with your middle and upper back placed firmly on a Swiss ball. Raise your hips so that your body forms a straight line from your knees to your shoulders. Hold your arms straight out in front of your chest with your palms together. Brace your core and roll your upper body to the right as far as you can. Without dropping your hips, reverse your movement and roll all the way back to the left as far as you can. That's one rep. Swiss Ball Dumbbell Overhead Tricep Extension Grab a pair of dumbbells and sit upright on a Swiss ball. Hold the dumbbells at arm's length above your head, your palms facing each other. Without moving your upper arms, lower the dumbbells until your forearms are at least parallel to the floor. Pause, then straighten your arms to return the dumbbells to the starting position. Swiss Ball Push-Up Get into a push-up position with your shins on a Swiss ball and your hands on the floor. Keeping your body straight, push yourself up and pause for a second. Swiss Ball Reverse Fly Lie face down on a stability ball, keeping it under your stomach, with legs straight and using light dumbbells. Do a reversible fly by squeezing your shoulder blades together and pull arms into a wide arc. Hold at your highest point for a second, lower and repeat. Swiss Ball Reverse Hip Raise Lie chest down on a Swiss ball and place your hands flat on the floor. Lift your legs until your thighs are in line with your torso. Pause, then lower to the starting position.
Swiss ball rollout. Sit on your knees in front of a Swiss ball and place your forearms and fists on the ball. Keep your core braces and slowly roll the ball forward, straightening your arms and expanding your body as far as you can without allowing your body to collapse. Use your abs to pull the ball back to your knees. That's one rep. Swiss ball wall squat. Grab a Swiss ball behind you and stand so that the ball is pinned between your back and the wall. Place your feet about two feet in front of your body. Make sure you keep your back in contact with the ball. Lower your body until your upper thighs are at least parallel to the floor. Push through your heels to the starting position. Toe touch. Lie face up on the floor with your legs and arms straight. Hold a medicine ball as you do the exercise. In one movement, lift your torso and legs as you bring the ball toward your feet. Lower your body back to the starting position. Walking high knees. Stand tall with your feet shoulder width apart. Without changing your posture, raise your left knee as high as you can and step forward. Be careful not to round your lower back. Repeat with your right leg. Continue to alternate back and forth. Weighted one-sided crunch. Lie on your back with your knees bent and your feet flat on the floor. Hold a dumbbell with both hands by your right shoulder. Curl your torso up and rotate to the left side. Lower yourself, finish the set on that side, then switch directions and repeat for your right side. Wide Grip Barbell Deadlift Set up a barbell and roll it against your shins. Bend your hips and knees and grab the bar with an overhand grip, just about twice shoulder width apart. Without allowing your lower back to round, pull your torso back and up and through your heels and thrust your hips forward, standing up with the barbell. Then lower the bar to the floor under control, keeping it as close to your body as possible. Wide Grip Pull-Up Place your hands well outside your shoulders with an overhand grip. Let your body hang at arm's length. Pull your chest to the bar. Once the top of your chest touches the bar, pause and then slowly lower your body to a dead hang. 